Our wet spring could cause some big problems this summer for firefighters. Grasses and ground plants that feel those fires are growing tall and then they'll soon dry out. KXY's Eric Loney live this morning with details on the fire outlook. Not looking so good, Eric. You know, it's uh, right now the fire danger in Spokane County already at moderate. This is Guy Gifford of the DNR, and the outlook in general you, you, we've been talking about, it looks like it's going to be shorter because the precipitation we've had, but intense. Yeah, we expect fire season to be what we call delayed, starting mid-July, the height of the fire, the fire season starting getting going, going through August, maybe September. So we're going to be a little shorter than our normal years. And with all the rain, what you're seeing is you're seeing the fuels have grown taller, say, than normal. Yeah, the grasses have a lot more moisture to grow taller this year than in previous years. So the potential is that to dry out this summer, and we have more potential dry fields to burn during fire season. And where are we seeing uh, sort of the predictions? Where does it look like it's going to be worse? Some places it might be worse than other places. The predictions are similar to last year. They're, they're looking at the Okanagan area, the east slope of the Cascades, the Okanagan Valley, and up in the northern parts of Washington. One of the things they're predicting is more lightning in those areas, very similar to last year. So we are going to potentially have more fire starts, plus, of course, the dry fields. Okay. And then uh, always the prevention message that you that you talk about, because even now we can have fires. Even though it looks everything's green, it can still burn. That's true, and especially human-caused fires are the number one cause of fires, especially outdoor burning. And people can still burn, but they still need to be very careful this time of year because it may get shut down at any time. And check before you light every day to see if things are changing. And you had a phone number where you can actually call and check. Yeah, 1-800-323-BURN. Okay. All right, Guy Gifford, the Department of Natural Resources. Thanks very much. Guy, we're going to keep talking about this the next half hour, Nadine.